Hey there, it's Aviva from Elementor. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to add Lottie animations to your hero section. Here on this photography website, we have a downward pointing arrow icon in the hero section, which directs our visitors to click and automatically scroll down the page to see more. The arrow is a nice touch, but there's nothing like animations to really grab your visitors' attention and encourage them to interact with your website. Okay. Let's get started and open the page in Elementor. Before we get to work on our Lottie animation, we'll need to define the section we'll be linking to so that when we click the animation, it will know where to take us. Scroll down to the second section and in advanced, give it a CSS ID. We'll name it Food. This will indicate where the page should scroll after clicking the animation. Scroll back to the top and in Widgets, search for Lottie and drag it under the other elements. In Source, we can choose to use either a JSON media file or an external URL. The Lottie Files website has lots of good options, so we'll select external URL. Now go to the Lottie Files site to search for an animation. This one looks good. Open it and click the clipboard icon to copy the URL. Back in the Elementor editor, Paste the link in the external URL field. In link, select custom URL and type in the pound sign and food to link it to the food section, which we defined earlier. In settings, we'll leave the trigger on the default of viewport as well as on the default viewport settings. So the animation already plays when it's in view. Switch the loop to yes to keep the interaction continuous. Drag the slider a bit to the right to increase the play speed. In style, set the width to 10%. And in CSS filters, drag the brightness slider down to zero to change its color to black. Let's create some space above the animation. In advanced, unlink the padding to set individually and set the top to 35%. There, the animation is ready. Let's update and preview. And here's our scroll animation, inviting us to interact with it. Neat! And that's all there is to creating an interactive scroll animation in Elementor. For more tutorials, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching!